All right, boys, welcome back to another video here today. Yes, you've seen the title. This is a gem guide. I haven't recorded a gem guide for a while now. I think what the last one I made was for Liz. So before Liz dropped, that was the last gem guide I did, which was about, what, four weeks ago? So it's been some time, not even five weeks ago, right? So it's been a while since I recorded a gem guide here today. I'm bringing it back because a lot of people have been asking for it. Again, there will be a thing that I wanted to mention in this video, and I'll title it as such. In the future, gem guides will become more scarce for me because... Netmarble has kind of ruined my, you know, way to make it. I'll show it to you here today. If you're new to the channel, like it, subscribe, let's jump into it. Let's break it down. <laughs> First off, as you guys all know, when I make gem guides, and if you don't, you know, if you don't know what I'm saying here, you haven't seen my last gem guides, this doesn't, you know, kind of matter to you. But what happens is, with a gem guide, right? How I do them is I always, like, structure to release them when we see the JP update on Thursday, and we've already seen the JP update previously. So, how it works is we have about two to three updates worth of content where I can show you what is coming up in a few weeks. Um, and we have leaks already. So we had about six weeks, five weeks of pure things we know of what's coming. Final boss leaks, final boss stuff like that. So usually I jump on Fridays. That's after the Thursday update for JP. So basically with what's the next week after global and then the week, you know, after that. So basically the entire point to make this uh, super easy to understand, you have future things to look forward to, right? You would, for example, have the information of what's coming out on 7.12 and what's coming out on 7.19 with leaks and other information based on what 7.26 and 8.2 will bring you, correct? Now, if you look at it here, 7.5, it's a, it's a pretty dead number. It's a pretty dead date right here. There is nothing. Literally, all I can give you is the information for 7.5. And again, 7.12, we don't know what's dropping, right? On JP, we will get that update over here on, um, what is it, in three days, which will be the 7th. Again, if I upload this video on the 7th, you don't need what's dropping tomorrow. You don't care what's dropping tomorrow. So remember, moving forward, I can't give you any insight of what's coming up uh, when it comes to new content gems, right? I can still provide you this, which is the free-to-play totals um, and what you can base get from it. Again, is that really helpful right now? Um, when this was the biggest thing, having the ability to see how many gems I can pick up in just various contents. Sure, I can guess, but I don't want to do that. If I go and guess and say, okay, you should get this and you don't get this and you went already 540 to a banner and you needed those extra 60 that I guessed, guess what? You got screwed. So with that being said, I'm trying to bring this out to you and just alert you that moving forward, I only will upload gem guides when it comes to like a massive banner, like before a, uh, a festival, before a collaboration. And I'll be like, all right, this is what you can obtain. You can obtain these values and then whatever we know of what possibly to the to the bare minimum, right? Like, for example, final boss, we should get that every month. Um, again, remember, legend difficulty exists. So that's not even a, a guaranteed factor. Story, I guess, is the closest thing to a guaranteed factor. Tower Trials, it's really spontaneous. Who knows when they drop those? So again, it sucks. It really does. If it's like a massive gemmed out update, um, like for example, you have, uh, what is it, this Liz update? We had like, what, 400, 500, 600 gems in it. So if it's an update like that, I'm able to record it properly and do it. Um, but yeah, back to the actual gem guide, back to everything here. For the uh, the content stuff, right? Again, dailies, you get 102 a week, um, which is basic stuff. That's what you get. Um, then we have this for the you know actual update. 30 gems should be from story. Final boss is going to pay you out 35. That is a total of 65 right there. There will be no channel trials, obviously speaking. Then when it comes to special event income, that will be 10 gems. I'm going to say that is from the, uh, what is it, the Demonic Beast, because you have those clear rewards. Um, or what is it, the, the achievements, right? So those achievements will give you gems. I think altogether it's 333. Uh, so it's nine or i think i missed one too so let's say 10. um so that's that special missions you're not getting anything um special boss battle nothing reward dungeon limited missions free tickets even you barely you barely get anything in this update when it comes to gems mostly it's just paying you off from last update so a super 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 dead update um if you did look at it brunhild was super dead when it uh, came to the gems then when you look at it um what is it it was who was next after that melly didn't have anything literally no content or nothing there so Again, Liz was the only big update of gems, and that was the 300 login. After that, it's been a little bit more lackluster, and gaining gems has just been slow. So, with that being said, there you go. Then, moving forward, right, again, do this weekly for more gems, character affinity, uh, five-star your SSR equipment, Fort Soldier's wheel spins, all of that still stands, and it's, again, 40 for all these weeks. Now, for dates, just so you know, 
everything and for everyone asking in my last video everything ends on 712 okay so you still got time with that um freyer will jump today and he will last all the way till 719 he does not leave he's a two-week banner then on 719 for global we will see summer Deanne as leaked um again there could be a second unit on there who knows what happens there or it could get scrapped i doubt it we've been having like literally precise leaks for how long now so summer Deanne it is after summer Deanne, guess what it is fez time eight uh two should be uh the drop of the fez which again if you look at it global's fez usually drops um later than that but because of this new merge it's dropping e2 so i mean a there's some i guess for people that want a hyped unit there's some pluses here but again this merge this entire one week thing has really uh nuked a lot of things so again you have no idea what's coming next you have no idea of anything leaks are your best friends right now um because with just basic information you can't go off much so again based off of this your bare minimum like let's just say this is only only from the uh guaranteed content plus an additional whatever i put here 65 um, and then 10 there you're getting 655 by the time you approach 8-2 you can kind of see with my gem guides we at least reach 900 um a thousand gems because i'm able to go and compile the information for the upcoming weeks i can't which means 655 again most likely you'll easily reach 900 if we go off of freebies and stuff like that so by then you'll be able to go and amass enough to go on to the any banner again if you want to go and summon for freyer you can go and summon for freyer and still have enough to amass there um because if you're looking at it you have four more weeks with the any so with everything, if you are saving for that, you're going to be fine. Uh, if you are saving for free and you want to go and spend on him and you're wondering, yo, can I reach him before he leaves? You will be able to acquire a 185, 110, and 110 before he leaves. Let's say that's about, what, 400 gems? So, not bad there. You have all of this to look forward to. Again, with this gem guide, it's a little bit more bare bones, and I apologize for that. I'm usually able to give you, like, a, what is it, an actual good idea of what's coming out. But here, again, I have no future sight. I have no information of what's dropping soon. So... It's just whatever it dropped this week, next week, you probably won't get anything because it's a dead week anyways. So the five day gap hurts us uh, a little bit there. But again, if you're going free to play and you're amassing this many gems, by this point, if you have 300, you're reaching 955. By this point over here on the Annie, um, if you already had 1,100, just with the additional gems you're getting, it's going to become 1755. So it's again, it's all depending on how much you're saving, depending on how much you have right now. For example, I'm at 700, around 750. So at this point, if I save fully, I'm on 726. When uh, it's like summer DNs last week, I'll be at 1405, which means I'll be fine for the entire Annie. Again, this is bare minimum amounts, which means I most likely will be at like 1600. Um, that's if Netmarvel actually drops more events, which they got the gap down. They're making more money. Hopefully we start seeing more stuff. And I hope that they don't continue this idea of where they go back to Legend Final Bosses. I'm really hoping they don't because I just have a thing that this month they will. I'm hoping they don't. If they do, consider, um, you know, doing Final Bosses more and more as the basic 30 gem thing that's a good thing to have monthly um if they bring back that other what is it like war ancient war event that had gems there too tower of trials didn't have gems this month so hopefully the next one does again we'll see that new content hopefully that has gems too so many ways that they can go and fix this up a little bit uh, but yeah this was the worst gem guide ever made with that being it thank you for watching hope you guys uh enjoyed and hopefully this was helpful to you for your dropping today and then all the way up until a2 you kind of have a kind of an idea of what's uh, what's dropping what's coming hopefully annie is good and i hope it's not chandler i hope it's somebody like you know zeldris would be would be great Estarosa, fine maybe we finally get him um i don't think Mayo would drop but you know there's a chance who knows i'm hoping for somebody cool so again if it's chandler a, it is what it is let's see thank you for watching peace out everyone enjoy i will catch you guys in the next one have fun and stay safe